Most moms know the benefits of breastfeeding for their child. Now, researchers at the University of South Carolina believe moms can also benefit, specifically by reducing the risk of developing one of the most deadly forms of breast cancer. It's a study geared toward African-American mothers, and researchers need more participants. Darcy Strickland shows us how the very thing giving your baby life could also save yours. Unfortunately, black women are less likely to be diagnosed with breast cancer, but more likely to die. At the University of South Carolina, research happens in the College of Nursing that's changing lives for women around the world. Dr. Tisha Felder hopes that at the end of this story, you'll understand how breastfeeding saves lives. In my community, you don't really hear black women talking about um, breastfeeding. Researchers have found that breastfeeding is not only good for your baby, but also greatly reduces the risk of developing one of the most deadly forms of breast cancer. There's been a lot of growing research that um, has been showing that there's a very strong relationship between um, breastfeeding and reducing the risk of these very aggressive, hard to treat breast cancers. So we hear a lot about triple negative cancers, for example, those type of cancers. And breastfeeding can reduce the rate of developing those cancers by about 60%. So why don't more women breastfeed, specifically African-American women in the South? A Centers for Disease Control and Prevention report looked at women across the United States from 2011 through 2015. It found that out of 885 African-American women in South Carolina, only 10%, roughly 85 women breastfed exclusively for six months. That number dropped to below 70 for moms who nursed an entire year. National numbers show 77% of new moms at least try to breastfeed. In South Carolina, that number is much lower for African-American women at 55%. We want to make sure that women understand that we're not shaming anyone who doesn't because we understand how complex it is, but we really do want to do everything we can to help women get the resources and support should they choose to breastfeed. The scientific benefits are without question. I think it's really just getting back to realizing that this is a very normal, natural process. And, um, and again, there's so many physical benefits, emotional benefits in, in doing it. Dr. Felder's five-week intervention study with new moms will use social media and social support to encourage breastfeeding for the first six months. So our project is called Mocha Mama's Milk, and we are looking for um, pregnant African-American women. They just need to be at least 21 years of age and um, speak English, and that's pretty much it. Darcy Strickland, News 19, WLTX. To learn more about becoming a part of this research, head to our website, WLTX.com, and click on this story.